All right, and here we go for the finale. Finally about to get my eye level 600 cloak. If you missed any of the other parts, there is a link to the playlist, the entire playlist in the description. You can figure it out from there. But this has been absolutely tremendous, and I do want to get this done, so we're going to go right to it. Ace logo, let us have it, man. Welcome back, champion. Excellent work with the Celestials. Can you believe how chatty they were? I just wanted them to hand us our reward, but they were just talk, 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 talk. I'm sorry, where were we? Oh yes, I have something for you. The very spirits of Pandaria are supporting us in our Grand Crusade. Behold! The strength of the White Tiger. The wisdom of the Jade Serpent. The fortitude of the Black Ox. And from the Red Crane, a shining beacon of hope for a better world. It is ready. There's a hidden darkness to this land. Do you feel it? My work is not quite finished. This cloak will grant you the power of the Celestials. Very soon, we will be able to augment your cloak with my own formidable draconic powers. Continue to aid your allies in the war effort. I will contact you shortly. Utterly breathtaking. I mean, what do you say? This has been amazing. This is, it's so fucking well done. And everybody thought that it, when everybody was going to get the legendary thing, that it was going to be like, oh, it's stupid. It's going to be lame. But this is so fucking well done. It's not even funny. And the fact that everybody has access to it, but very few people who, you know, if you haven't raided since day one of Mop and continue to raid, you probably don't have this. And you certainly don't have it as quick as I have it. So. I love it. What, what else can I say now? There's a few things that I do want to talk about before we end. Uh, in the, the the Celestials part, he was hinting at Burning Legion stuff. In fact, in the Crane one, which you, you should have seen already, but if you haven't, it's in the playlist. Uh, that's the healing one. He literally says he knows for a fact that the Burning Legion are going to come. And they're going to... And that day, like... He hopes that we could survive it, and that's his his sliver of hope. That's all he has. Go watch that again if you haven't seen it, because I literally type out like it makes me. If I had my mic plugged in, I probably would have screamed at that point. But that is awesome. That is amazing, and that really, really is foreshadowing. So, uh, other than that, he is starting to go down the dark path a bit, but uh, we'll see what happens with that. Now, the next part is coming up at five point four. He's talking about augmenting it with his own draconic powers. It says, events are in motion. We have one final task to complete before we're ready to move. My agents tell me that King Rin and, you know, whatever, Vulgin, all that shit. Speak to me again as soon as they are ready to converge 
on the gates. We will bring this war to a glorious conclusion. So I'm praying to the wow gods that there's going to be some crazy scene in front of the gates and he's going to bust the fucking door down and all this shit is going to come to a head. I cannot wait to see what they have in store. Let me know if you guys think you have an inkling as to what's in store, but otherwise I really, really do hope you've enjoyed this series. I know it was a bit long. Obviously the videos were each, you know, well over 10 minutes each because of the lore stuff, but I really did want it to be that way. So enjoy it. I fucking, I'll see you guys in 5.4, man.